There's a large stand mixer you can buy from KitchenAid. This is called the Pro uh, Series, I believe, That's Professional correct. Bowl Lift. Mm -hmm. Then there's the Artisan Tilt Head Stand Mixer, the one I own in my kitchen. And then their little brother came on the scene this year and has taken the KitchenAid world by storm. I was just at the International Home and Housewares show, and I have to tell you, everybody was clamoring about the mini. <gasps> Asking about it, wondering when it was going to be at retail. Ding, ding, it's at retail. It's on QVC. We've had it on one time before, Tina Varelli, and it smoked our phone lines. <laughs> like, <laughs> burned them down. It was so popular. Good to have you back, friend. Hi. Nice to see you. This is very special. And while the footprint is smaller, Tina, mm -hmm. we don't want anyone to be misled. This is still a powerful mixer and one that turns out quite a bit right. of what you put inside. That's right. Just as powerful as our standard tilt head stand mixer. And it is that tilt head that everyone loves because you have easy access to changing your beaters. You get four of them and for adding ingredients. So I just added my dry ingredients to make my cupcakes and I'm going to turn it on. And what you're not going to see is you're not going to see flour flying out of the bowl because this stand mixer has 10 distinct speeds and a stir speed which starts extra extra low and it also has a soft start feature so even if you accidentally push it right to speed six it's going to take a moment and let the ingredients and then kick it into high speed so that helps keep all the ingredients in that three and a half quart stainless steel bowl that is dishwasher safe so you're making cupcakes was this a box cake mix this is a homemade cake mix but I did a whole lot of testing when I received my mini and it can handle perfectly my regular cupcake recipes. It can handle my cake mixes, a whole batch of chocolate chip cookies. You know the recipe that's right on the bag. Oh yes. Mm -hmm. Over two pounds of mashed potatoes. Oh wow. So pretty much any of your regular batches I had no problem with. Now these attachments are uniquely designed for the mini. If you have one of the larger mixers those attachments don't work on this one. So it's important to know we've got the flex edge beater in the mini size. In the mini size. We've got the work beater, we've got the dough hook, and we have the wire whip. Now, what is our value? Take a look at the left hand side of your screen. If you were to go to retail to buy this same offer, you would expect to pay a whole lot more for it. In fact, the flex edge beater and the mini at retail is $369.98. We are $110 less. Wow. How about that? Wow. But wait, I'm not done. There's a mail-in offer. Now you heard me mention this earlier and I told you that if you bought the mini tonight on QVC and you send in the mail-in offer, KitchenAid, because they love you, was going to send you <laughs> something back. And they were going to send it back to you and it's going to be something you want. You know what it is? A food grinder attachment. Here we go, back here. Food grinder attachment. So this actually attaches onto the power hub of any mm -hmm. KitchenAid stand mixer you have, because remember, while the uh, the mixer is many, the power hub is the same size. That's right. And so now you can make your own ham salad, you can do your own ground beef, you can do whatever you like, and this comes as a free mail-in offer for you. Now, here are colors, and I will tell you, when we had this on on Cook Event, we sold out of a color. Mm -hmm. And one of our colors is very limited, I think, <gasps> down to the single digits, wow. right? So this is Empire Red, mm -hmm. very popular. Also Contour Silver, also very popular. I've got it for you here in the black. Matte black. 450 in the black. That's a matte wow, black, isn't yes. it? Yes. And then here I've got it for you in twilight blue, 220. Which one is sold out? Honeydew. Oh, honeydew. All right. Uh, no, I think you need some Bruce in here because we fed him. Okay. <laughs> and so he's strong. And Samantha, we're going to get you some supper later. Okay, I promise. All right. So honeydew is gone, and hot sauce. I love the name Hot Sauce, PSM, by the way. <laughs> Maybe I should get a dog and name him Hot Sauce. Wouldn't that be fun? Be like an In the Kitchen with David mascot. Don't know what kind it would be. I may be getting myself into big trouble by suggesting this. All right. Um, hot Sauce, I have five left. Oh. And where's Melissa? Melissa, if Hot Sauce sells out, it's you, baby. You'll come and get it? Okay. Melissa's one of, one of our studio coordinators. See, when you work on my show, I call you out on national TV, <laughs> I do. I do. Whether you like it or not. Yeah. So, exactly. All right, so let's talk to you about six easy payments. Let's talk about that great food grinder attachment with the mail-in yes. offer. Yes. But let's never be um, 
misguided that this does not do the big batches. That is right. So it can handle all those single batches, like I said, your cake mixes, your homemade cake recipes, your brownies, um, all kinds of mashed potatoes, which I'm mixing up here. And I am just sh wanted to show you that here's that attachment hub. That hasn't changed all the way back to 1919. So when you get that food grinder or you get that spiralizer, it's going to work perfectly, no matter what um, stand mixer you have. And, and Miss Tina, may I interrupt you just real quickly yes. because I need to do a quick color tour. We have another update for okay. you. Okay, so here's the Empire Red, most popular. Here's the Contour Silver. Remember, we're $110 less than retail tonight. Mm -hmm. This is a great, great buy. This is the Matte Black. This is Twilight Blue, 200 left, and Melissa, your time has come oh, no. to retrieve the mixer. You're an associate producer. I called you a product coordinator. You were just recently promoted, weren't you? Yes. Were you just recently promoted? Are your mom and dad watching tonight? My mom. Probably. What is her first name? Linda. Winda? Linda. Linda. Sounds like Winda, but it's Linda. <laughs> All right, here we go. So, Linda, we're proud of your girl. Here is the hot sauce. Thank you. I don't think I should call a dog hot sauce. Maybe Tabasco. Tabasco might come here, Tabasco. Yeah, that might that's better. That's better. All right, so let's come back over here. We're making loaded mashed potatoes like those that twice baked potato casserole we're that's doing right. with today's special value. And I used that flat beater. So we started with the flex edge. We went to the flat beater because we wanted some texture there in those smashed potatoes. And here I'm using that wire whip, and it is going to whip up a dozen eggs all at once. So you can make that custard mixture, David, like you did for your recipe today. I have a strata down here in front that has some spiralized zucchini in it, adding your ingredients. Now remember, this is 25% lighter than our standard tilt head stand mixer and a 20% smaller footprint. So, so great for apartments if you've downsized, if you want something just a little bit lighter. How about people just starting out, young couples? What a great gift for a wedding. Right. And it is still powerful enough to handle all those spring baking tasks that you have. I hear a lot of people saying that they even want to buy them for the young baker in their life. I want you to know also this is a much smaller footprint. So when we take a look back here at the really the, uh, the, um, the history of the stand mixer, Mm -hmm. The professional bowl lift is the Mac Daddy. That's the big that guy, is, right? right? That's the one that does like, I don't know, 72 batches of cookies or something. <laughs> uh, not quite that many, but it's a lot. Um, here is the professional. Here is the artisan tilt head. Right. And here is the brand new mini. We're so excited about this. <laughs> it's the little brother to the other mixers, but very mighty in terms of its power so, and yes. its capacity. Let's take a look. We have a little animation to show you. And would love for you to narrate for us here, Miss, Miss Tina. Okay, so there is that beautiful styling of the Artisan Mini Mixer. It is just so gorgeous. It is like artwork on your countertop. And there it is next to its big sister, the Artisan 5 Quart. You get those four beaters, 10 speeds, including a super low stir speed. And you're still going to get that efficient, perfect KitchenAid mixing action. You're going to have the beater going around the bowl. Oops. And there is that attachment hub with the spiralizer inside. Which we're going to present next. We are. So this works with over 10 different attachments. So 25% lighter, 20% smaller footprint, and all the power of our standard tilt head stand mixer. Can I tell you also that if you take a look at the left hand side of your screen, we're going to put our value story up. And this value story has been tremendous. We debuted this on our cook event a couple of weeks ago. Mm -hmm. It was wildly popular, and if you went out to retail to buy the Mini with the special Flex Edge beater designed for this machine, that's right. You could pay three hundred sixty-nine dollars and ninety-eight cents. We are at two fifty-nine ninety-eight. We are one hundred ten dollars less than what you'd pay at retail. If you went to your local store to buy this mixer and got there and they said, well, yes, we not only have your color, but it's on sale for $110 off the regular price. Would you be pretty lucky? Would you think that was a pretty good day? That's I think an awesome we would, day. right? Yes. So this is Empire Red, most popular. Contour Silver, a close second for it, because if you have stainless steel appliances, this one's awesome. Here's the matte black. And finally, we have the Twilight Blue. I have fewer than 200 left in that Twilight Blue. Remember, this is six easy payments and 
you're going to have the brand new mini, the one that everybody is talking about. Oh, everyone is loving it. I'm hearing from so many people on Facebook. Mm -hmm. um, a lovely lady, Carol, today sent me a photo. She got her mixer today and already made the most beautiful scones, sent me a photo. I love everyone it. is loving the mini. Well, what do you say we get spiral over here? Ooh, all okay, right. Okay, after you, my darling. <laughs> now, remember, the power hub on KitchenAid's mixers has not changed since the brand began in 1919. Do you realize that if you went into the museum at KitchenAid, went to the very first mixer mm -hmm. they ever sold, which is there, right? and you took this spiralizer from the year 2017 and you attached it to the first mixer from 1919, it would work. And the reason it would work is the power hub has not changed in nearly 100 years. Right. Isn't that crazy? It's amazing. It's amazing. It's just a testament to the quality of KitchenAid and just how um, much people just love and enjoy the products. Well, I'll tell you, this particular spiralizer is going to allow you to do the curlies, like the vegetable noodles or what we call the voodles. You're going to be able to do curly fries. You'll be able to do apple slices. It'll core the apple at the same time that it slices the apple. I mean, there are so many things you can do with this attachment, and it all works on this spring-loaded system. It does. Look at how it is handling that tough sweet potato. I love this spiralizer because it is so simple. It's really just an arm that attaches to your stand mixer, and then you have four different blades and a peeling blade. So it's just so simple to use. I love to take this out. Um, and make all kinds of recipes, whether it's salads or fries or baked chips. So here I'm demonstrating these two different blades. So you're gonna get two different sizes of the um, spiralizing blade. These make the, like the spaghetti cuts or the noodle cuts. So one is a medium cut and one is a coarser cut. And then over here, this is gonna be the slicing blade. You're gonna get two 